Okay, you want to click and find an image that is drawn and that it's downloadable and free. I chose her. I click visit. And then download for free. I've already downloaded her. And then when I came to Cricut, I want to add. And I want to upload. There she is. I'm going to add to canvas. And it's going to take a minute because it's going to download and it's going to be too large. So it's going to take a few minutes. Okay, so there she is. And I'll click down here to reduce her to get rid of the warning sign that it's too mm -hmm. large. When you click on it, it'll tell you that it's too large. So I want to keep downsizing her until the warning goes away and I want to keep her highlighted and I want to go up here to pin I want to draw her let me go up just a little bit and then let's see make it and I want her to be on a 12 by 12 which she is here and then we'll click continue I want to collect a pen color open up the flap arrow down close the flap so in order for your choices to come up at this point you want to put your Cricut dial on custom and then um, let's browse printable vinyl let's type it up here Click that. Done. And I purchased this Cricut printable vinyl on Amazon. It's only it, you get ten sheets for six eighty eight. And insert it in the Cricut, of course, on the mat, and it will print. Now, printable vinyl is considered permanent. So you could put it on things like, you know, your phone cases, um, you know, uh, vinyl uh, folder fronts, things like that. It's not an iron-on vinyl, okay? And that's it.